It's finally time, everyone. It's time for the champion battle of the Elite Four in Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Roulette. Hoenn Gone Nuzlocke. What's going on, everybody? Dunsparce for the win here yet again, and welcome back. Yes, today is our final battle before the post-game, and we are pretty much ready to take on... Uh, well, what's his name? Wallace in this one, yeah. <laughs> it's Steven in Ruby Sapphire, but it's Wallace in this one, and yes, we are finally ready to take on Wallace, the the water user. Which, he's actually not that tough overall. I don't know why they put him as the champion. But, anyways, I'm going to put Hangover in the lead because I do have his whole team set up right here. And, eh, it shouldn't be that difficult. Um, what I'm just worried about... I'm going to go start this battle off and hit that Waylord because that's what he leads with, with a Water Spout, or with a Thunderbolt. It's probably going to take it out, but I just want to, basically, uh, I don't want to do this, but I'm probably just going to. I'm just going to set up against him with Hangover, just because I just don't want to chance anything. So... Without f further ado, let's get started with this battle. Welcome, G. That incident in Sotopolis City. That was superb work, putting an end to that crisis all by yourself. Oops! It wouldn't be fair to say that you alone ended the crisis. You overcame that difficult situation by working as one with your Pokémon. We trainers raise Pokémon by giving them items and by teaching them new techniques for battle. But we ourselves also learn many things from Pokemon. This is where your achievements are put to the test against what others like you have achieved. Now! Who can most elegantly dance with their Pokemon in Hoenn? Show me right here and now! So this is a dance-off? It's not actually a Pokemon battle? Well then I should win easy. I'm a great dancer. <laughs> actually I'm not. I suck at dancing. But yes, he is going to have six Pokemon and as I said, lead off with a Wailord. And it is level 57, so I might not take it out with a Thunderbolt, but I just don't want a chance getting a full HP Water Spout in the face, so let's hit it with a Thunderbolt. It might not take it out, but Waylord's defenses aren't the greatest. Um, okay, yeah, I figured it wouldn't. Yeah, there's the Water Spout. Uh, how much is it gonna do? Oh, that's doing nothing. Let's start setting up against this thing. Yeah, this thing, this Wailord, shouldn't be too big of a problem. I'm just going to start setting up like crazy against it, because all it's got is Rain Dance, Water Spout, Double Edge, and Blizzard, so it's not really going to be doing much to us. Surprisingly, Wailord's all physical damage, er, it's not physical, it's all HP and attacks, really, surprisingly. I would think that a whale, it would have huge HP, okay, double edges, yeah, might hurt, <gasps> okay, yeah, that r really hurts, um, let's go for a hyper potion then, and unfortunately we have two calm minds up now, so he's gonna heal, and water spout is really gonna hurt, so we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to take this whale lord out with only plus two, I didn't want that. I was hoping he wouldn't hit his double edge, but oh well. This, um, actually, you know what? He's got a ten. He might send out that. No, maybe not send out the tentacruel because it does have toxic, but it's also weak to me, like really badly. So Hangover's level 53 now. Yeah, he is sending out his tentacruel. All right. Um. Sludge Bomb might actually hurt. So let's go for a double team. Hopefully it's not going to do much. Um, Tentacruel overall isn't that offensive. Oh, of course you use Toxic. But I don't really want to be Toxic'd. 
Um. <laughs> oh, I can't toxic him because he is poison type. Um, I'm just going to full heal. Err. Uh, yeah, I want to see how much. I want to see how much Sludge Bomb is doing, and same with Hydro Pump, because, well, how much is Sludge Bomb doing? Uh, oh, that does quite a bit, actually. Uh, so let's try and take this thing out. Yeah, we're going to take this thing out, because I can't risk getting hit by another Sludge Bomb. Because if I just keep healing up, that's going to be pointless, and if he gets a crit, I'm done. So, Ludicolo's up next, and, oh, it's got Double Team and Leech Seed, but it can't really do damage to me, per se, so, um, because I do have, it's only got special attacks on it, so, hopefully, with plus two evasiveness, Leech Seed can, oh, hello, Surf. Oh, yeah, that's doing nothing, but, if he gets a crit, that's bad because now he can probably take me out. So let's hyper potion it up. Yeah, this is actually surprisingly a difficult setup, but then again, it is the champion, so you can't exactly set up too easily against him. So, oh, now he's setting up double teams. Um, you know what? Uh, gosh darn it, this is scary. Um, uh... I've got three double teams up. If he tries to... You know, I think I'm pretty good right now. I've got... Th yeah. I've got three double teams and four Calm Minds up. So I think I'm pretty good to take out pretty much anything on his team at this point. So, except for that Milotic. That Milotic might be a problem. And if... Well, up next is the Whiskash anyways, so... Let's just hope it doesn't set up amnesias like crazy. Actually, this thing can... <laughs> I'm not even going to chance that. Um, so... Let's just psychic it, it and take that thing out because I can't chance anything. And... Wow! Only two Pokemon left and it's his Gyarados, which is coming out right now, and his Milotic, so... Alright, Gyarados. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything because I'm not a physical attacker. I'm going to hit this thing with a Thunderbolt, and I'm faster. Interesting. Well, I guess Gardevoir is pretty fast, but... Eh. And this thing could be a problem, but it's not. We, we hit it with a Thunderbolt, and it dies. And his last Pokemon, his ace, the Milotic. That is right. And this thing is might be a problem. Might be. So let's hit it with a Thunderbolt. Hopefully it's a one-shot, but then again, it's a Milotic, okay? so I won't be surprised if we don't take it out. And we do. Wow. Okay. Um, note to self. Um, no setup moves for the next Elite Four. Wow. That was... Wow. Anyways, I, the champion, fall in defeat. That was wonderful work. You were elegant, infuriatingly so. And yet, it was utterly glorious. Kudos to you, G. You are a truly noble Pokemon trainer. I finally think I got a voice for him down. The Pokemon you sent into battle. At times they danced like a spring breeze, and at times they struck like lightning. <laughs> and I was striking with lightning quite often. It was with light yet sure-footed elegance that you led your Pokémon. Even I felt bedazzled by your masterful performance. You now stand at the glorious peak of the Pokémon League. I now proclaim you to be the new Hoenn region. Oh no! What are you doing here, G? And how'd you get past the rest of the... Uh, how'd you get past the rest of the Elite Four? Eh, no matter. G! How would you like some advice before challenge the... What the? Oh, what's going on? I... Oh, I must have clicked off. Oh well. Sorry! <laughs> ha blah blah blah, yes. What? Did it, did it, G? Are you trying to tell me you've beaten the champion? And here comes Professor Birch. See, what did I tell you, Brendan? Didn't I tell you that you don't need to worry about G? Da -da 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 -da. 
Gee, you've finally done it. When I heard that you defeated your own father at the Petalburg Gin, I thought perhaps you had a chance. But to think you've actually become the champion? Ah, yes. What became of your Pokedex? Here, let me see. And yeah, this is uh, what he does. And he's like so... He's like so upset. Oh, you don't catch Pokemon! Blah, 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 yeah. And we all know this. It's... We've played this game a million times over, so... This room. This is where we keep... Oh, come on! Stop clicking off of that! I'm just going to keep my mouse over top of the game itself. This is where we keep records of Pokemon that prevailed through harsh battles. It is here that the League Champions are honored. I am... S come on, let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokemon League and the names of the partners who battled with you. But I seriously am surprised that I didn't lose a single Pokemon during this whole thing. Well, except for Baltoy. Poor, poor Baltoy. You will be missed. But, Hangover, the God of War! Janine, the Swampert! Angel 2.0, the Dunsparce! Grace, the Metagross! And Harold the Pidgeotto. And Jaws the Fur Alligator. We are now in the Hall of Fame. That is right, everybody. That means. Oh, yes, there's me. Blah, blah, blah. I'm a girl. League champion, congratulations. But, yeah, I had a lot of fun with this Nuzlocke run. I really did. And. I'm still gonna be doing a couple more things in the after game, but really not much. I'm gonna be battling a couple people for for the just to get levels up. I might do a few grinding episodes. I don't know. I mean, it's not gonna be that exciting. I'm not gonna go take on Steven right away just because I know for those of you that have been watching Clef's uh, was watching Clef's LP of it. He Basically, we... He just went straight to Steven the next episode. But, er, no, I think he went to the Battle Frontier and then to Steven. But, yeah, either way, um, I just... I put in a rule I did, f neglected to tell him. Uh, I told everyone else, but I neglected to tell him that we're only allowed to grind up five levels off-screen in between the Elite Four and Steven. So I am going to get a few levels on-screen before we fight. We might fight the Reggies, we might fight the Legendaries, etc., and get some levels off of that. But other than that, no. We're not going to be doing much in the after game because you don't catch le legendaries in a Nuzlocke run. You kill them. So we're going to kill the Reggies. We're going to kill Rayquaza, Groudon, Kyogre, etc. And there's other stuff, too. That I'm going to get some points for doing side quests, too. So um, in the end, I'll put all, all of my points at the very end. And yes, I am in the lead right now. I know, you're probably all right. Oh, you're cheating! No, it's because Clef lost so many Pokemon that... that he is so low. But, he was just doing it for... for fun. I mean, we all do it for fun. I mean, that's all I do it for. It, it's no big deal who wins, who loses, etc. I mean, I honestly wanted to lose, and hey, Tentacruel, my my starter. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, the cuts, the ending scenes, almost done, and that's really it, everybody. Um, once we finish with the, once we finish with this whole cutscene here, that's gonna be the end of the game, pretty much. I'm only gonna have like five more episodes of this, and that might be two, maybe three weeks. So, we're almost done this, everybody. So, the end. Let's just load up the game and save, and that's gonna be it. So, blah blah blah, Pokemon Emerald, the save file, yeah. Has been erased. What? Oh. Wait, what? What? 
Well, um, looks like I'm going to redo the battle with Wallace because that's why I have save states. Um, but anyways, yeah, um, I guess we're not going to fight Steven. I'm going to try and figure out what the heck just happened. So, yeah, everybody, um, next episode, hopefully we're going to be in the after game because I don't know what just happened here. Anyways, until next episode then, I'll see you later. Goodbye. Dunsparce for the win. Out.